All right, ladies and germs, it's the Labor Day cellophone event happening now over at Harbor Freight. So I got my catalog, 25% off coupon. I'm going to flip through it before I go inside. We're just going to see what kind of smoking deals I find in the catalog and what it is that I exactly plan on picking up. That being said, let's dive on into this catalog. All right, all right, so you guys are seeing it as I'm seeing it. Here's my 25% off coupon. Check it out. 44s going on sale. 439. Now, when we were down in Covina, they were having 75% off sale. Don't know if we're going to see that here, but it's always a good idea to look in the catalog before we go in. Ooh, there we go. Look at that. Rapid pump, four ton steel, floor jack, 150 instead of the 170 that I paid. All right, all right. Well, it pays to wait, that's for sure. There was something else in here that I was kind of eyeballing earlier. I was, uh, oh, yep, there we go. Look, $25 for the power strip. So that's a freaking hot deal right there if you need a power strip. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else we got going on in here. Microfiber rags. Microfiber rag, 119. Look at that, 13-piece half-inch drive. SAE metric impact sockets. 20 bucks, man. You can't beat it. All right, all right, all right. Adjustable stool for the Manraj with basket. 50 bucks. See what else looks pretty cool and pretty hot deal in here. Safety glasses, $1.29. Can't beat that. Look at that. Bauer's got a nice little vacuum here. Not sure I like the tip, but hey, if it works, it works. Let's see what else we got going on. Oh, look at the stool. 40 bucks. Those things are awesome, especially when you're working on diesels. Pocket code reader, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, okay, Syntec, OBD2, could be good just for a quick little, uh, you know, I am readiness monitor, quick clear, quick code. We're gonna, we might pick one of these up today, actually, and check that out. All right, all right, check it out. Magnetic socket rails, $13.99. Might pick one of those up while we're in here. Okay, I don't need a floor jack anymore because we got one, but they got some hot deals here. 129, 139, 179, 199. Get your Daytona on. Oh, let's see if this one went down in price. So they got the one for the 99.99. And then they got the one for 109.99 with jack stands. Alright, trying to keep this catalog full. Hang on, hang on. All right, let's check it out, check it out. Let's see the drill press. There's one for 130, and there's one we got at work, 190. Thing's freaking phenomenal, too, at 190. Freaking just keeps kicking butt. Engine stands, 750, 50 bucks, 1,000, 62, 2,000, 135. Let's see what their Zertex are going in here for. Here's one right here, 44.99. Another one here with live data. 89.99 obd2 with abs 140 obd2 with abs srs fix assist 200 man i could use one of those for the house for sure all right all right let's scroll through let's see what else we see here here's another one new compared to actron 30 bucks obd2 so what was the difference between that one and the one we saw for 25 oh the other one was a coupon that's what we did we, got, we went past the coupon page now. All right, all right. That's cool. Let's see if there's any other hot deals in here. There's a coolant pressure tester for 80 bucks. There's the oil uh, drain bucket for 130. We, like I said, we got one of those at work too. Things are freaking awesome. Trim stick, 750. Oh, check this out. Get your O2 sensor socket set on, 30 bucks. There's the 10-piece uh, bearing race and seal driver set that Shane's got, 30 bucks. There's some Ames DVOMs for you and some amp clamps. There's an Ames digital inspection camera, 180. Got another one here for 85. Nice. All right, so it looks like the things that I wanted to pick up today that are on page one and page two are already in the same exact section. So this makes it very uniquely friendly for me and easy for me to grab up and do. 
That is a freaking big gun for 60 bucks. I don't need anything that freaking big. Just a small thing like this would be fine. 26, I think I'm gonna grab that real quick. Let's toss that in the car. The other thing I was looking at, I think was a Syntec. This thing was only 25 bucks. Gonna grab that too, so all three items. Let's see, we got the uh, jump pack here. Here's my other folded page. We gotta go to the socket rails. And then I think the last item outside of that infrared gun. In fact, let's see, there's the infrared gun. I had that page folded was the pocket reader. All right, so I don't think it really matters. It didn't really specify in here exactly which ones did it. Let's see. But there was a socket rail that I was looking at specifically. It says $13.99, your choice, quarter inch, three eighths, or half inch. Is there a limit to how many you can get? I don't know. I'm probably good on the wrench organizer. Okay, let's focus. Socket rail, which one do I get? You know what, I don't need a socket rail, I'm good. I got the jump pack, I got the temp gun, and I got a mini pocket reader. So we got this high resolution digital inspection camera 180. Then you got the digital inspection camera for 80, but it's a 2.4, and this is a three and a half screen. If we look up here, this one's also 180, that's also a three and a half screen. And then if you look over here, this one's actually a 2.7 inch screen for 85 bucks. So that one actually might be the way to go if you're looking for one. All right, all right, all right. So I just got out of Harbor Freight. We are a little bit early for the Labor Day 25% off coupon. So your boy has got to come back on Monday, but check it out. My 25% coupon will work on one item, any item in the store. As far as I'm told, or as far as I believe, I don't know. I gotta look at it closer, but uh, I was gonna pick up this Ames digital inspection camera and he said it'll work and I was like, sweet. All right, so three items that you're gonna want as a mechanic at some point in time, all for $25, wow. Not to mention the 25% off coupon that I mentioned towards the end that I believe I can actually use for the Ames digital inspection camera, which I've never used, so I'm not exactly sure how good or bad it's gonna be. Overall, it, from the picture, it looks pretty dang good. We might have to come back and revisit it Monday because my 25% off coupon is only valid on Monday and Monday alone, so I might actually go back to Harbor Freight come Monday to pick up that Ames digital inspection camera and see what I think about it in a separate review. That being said, let's read what it doesn't cover. That way you guys know. One coupon per customer per day, 25% off. One item purchase cannot be used with any other discount coupon or the following items or brands. Inside Track Club, Extended Service Plan, Gift Card, Open Box Item, Three Day Parking Lot Sales Item, Compressors, Floor Jacks, Safes, Sawmills, Storage Cabinets, Chests or carts, trailers, welders, uh, Admiral, Ames, Bauer, Central, Machinery, Cobra, Cover Pro, Daytona, Diamondback, Earthquake, Fisher, Hercules, Icon, Jupiter, Linux, Poland, Predator, Tailgater, Viking, Vulcan, Zurich, and not valid on prior purchases, non transferable. Original coupon must be presented valid through 9-2 only. Harbor Freight, you're breaking my heart again. I had an employee tell me that I could totally pick up the Ames digital inspection camera and it would work with a 25% off coupon. He must be sadly mistaken or misinformed because it clearly says on your coupon that I can't use it for that. But I guess I can get a free flashlight. All right, I digress. Three items that you're gonna want as a mechanic at some point in time, if you don't have them, need to jump on this shit. $25 a piece, okay, with the coupons that I had during the Harbor Freight Labor Day sales event. Numero uno we picked up was this Viking 4 amp fully automatic micro sensor control battery charger maintainer slash AKA the jump pack, okay? Opening it up, this thing is dead as dead can be, so I've got to charge it. But, if I was to pull this bad boy out, rip off this nice little film, 
Man, this thing does look duty. Got a little plug right there. You got the jump fat feature here. You plug it in. Battery maintainer slash charger. Uh, it would appear that it would possibly also be a jump pack, but I think you'd have to actually have the battery charged up to a certain specification before you could jump it. You got a couple of different leads here. So if you have a motorcycle and you're looking to get the battery juiced up enough to where you can actually fire it up, turn it over, etc., you got the two little prongs here. You tie it on into the battery, one ground, one positive. Take the other end, plug it into so, and then away you go. So it's a battery maintainer slash charger. However, if you charge it up just enough, I'm sure you can leave it attached and jump start it. It's not a complete jump pack as I originally thought. So let me correct myself with that. However, not bad for 25 bucks. I have a motorcycle here. It sits here for a lot of months, especially considering all the road construction we have here in the high desert. I thought it was pretty cool. Now here's two little clips they have. We can clamp onto the positive and negative side of the terminal. Plus it has another end here. We can plug it in, this Viking deal. We can put it on a trickle charge and it will maintain the battery and or get it juiced up enough for us to fire over, especially if it's been sitting all summer, winter, etc. cetera. Now, any given Sunday, I'd love to ride that motorcycle around, make it my primary uh, means of transportation. However, it's just not in the books for me at the moment because we're putting in a new sewer system where I live. So as a result, all the roads are tore up from the floor up. You really need a car, truck, SUV to get through it. When it rains, you definitely need some four wheel drive, but I digress. Second tool, Syntec pocket reader, OBD2. I am ready to monitor. You can at least check to see what the monitor status is like. Pull a code, clear a code. At least that's my consensus. We'll plug this in. We'll do a completely separate review on it later to see if this is worth $25. But overall, if it can pull me a code and I can clear code, already $25 well spent. If I can check out the IM readiness monitors at the same exact time, already money well spent. Shows here uh, operating temperature 0 to 50 degrees Celsius, 32 degrees, 122 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, power, obviously uses the vehicle power for that. And then dimensions is 4.32 inches in length and about 3.05 in width and 0.83 in height so rock and roll we'll check that out last but not least you guys may already know from a previous video i did not have the best luck in the entire world with my ryobi temperature gun so i thought i'd pick up the ames temperature gun and to be honest overall it looks pretty duty for what it's worth it looks like it's going to be functional and work itself out it takes one nine volt battery to operate we're going to check this out and just see how much it either A, kicks butt, or B, sucks. So we're going to check that out and see what I think of it. Three automotive mechanic tools that you're going to need, aka want, at one point or another. That's all I got for this video, guys. I hope you enjoy your Labor Day sales with on. Hope you got to find something cool. I know, and I can only apologize for them so much. Harbor Freight, you got to make more things worthwhile with the 25% coupon and the 20% coupon. I love the fact that you do it, but can you please throw a brother a bone? Give me one solid platform that you sell that I can use this coupon on. If you can't, then don't give me the damn coupon. That's all I got for this video. Cheers to those of you that have your beers. I hope you enjoyed today's video. We'll see you next time. Deuces.